Good morning, folks. Welcome to Randy Shaves on this chilly, chilly Wednesday morning. Um, going to do a shave today. And here's what we're going to be using. Sterling Bay Rum. Very nice Bay Rum scent. I'm sure that uh, everybody out there, or most people out there, like Bay Rum. This is a real good one. Uh, I really like their scent. And with that... I'm going to be using, for an aftershave, I'm going to be using something that contains the Sterling Unscented Glacial, but I'm adding to that HCNC's Bay Rum Oil. Now, in my opinion, I mean, I love the Sterling Bay Rum, but in my opinion, Pete Hendricks has the Bay Rum market cornered. Uh, HCNC's Bay Rum is is the best I have ever gotten hold of, and I love it. Now, what I did is I took, you know, I like menthol, so I took the um, some of the glacial unscented Sterling, some of the HCNC Bay Rum, and some other things, some witch hazel and some uh, some. Uh, I call it white lightning alcohol. And I made me some splash, which works really well. So that's what I'll be using for the uh, software today. I've got the surprise, surprise. I've got the Yates 921, and I've got it loaded up with a brand new Permasharp. I have really been using these a lot lately, and I do that. You know, I go from blade to blade, and I'll get on a kick. I'm on the Permasharp kick right now. For the brush today, I've got a beautiful brush. It's a trotter. And I think they have names for their uh, different handles. And I don't know what the name of this one is, but I call it my pretty handle. So there you go. It's a trotter 26 millimeter. High dense, super high density knot. Uh, these are really uh, dense but they do a great job. And so that's my brush today. And that should just about do it. I'm going to put just a little water on my face. I just got out of the shower, so I'm in pretty good shape there. And I'm going to start lathering up with this Sterling Bay Rum. Very nice smelling Bay Rum. I finished things off with the uh, HCNC Bay Rum Splash that I made. One reason for that is, you know, soap scents don't really last after you get through shaving. They may last a few minutes or maybe an hour or two, but that's not what stays with you. What stays with you is the, your post-shave. Man, look at that lather. Look at that. Great lather. I love Sterling. And the trotter brush has something to do with all that, too. The tips of these things are so soft. That's going to do it. And... We'll heat the razor up just a little bit. Or I will. We won't. You won't. I will. There it is. With the new Permasharp in it. Let's shave. I was reading this morning on one of the groups about how uh, how much DE blades have gone gone up in price. Um, mine haven't because I've got so many already on hand. <laughs> Glad I bought them now. I think it's mainly I don't know this to be a fact, but I think it's mainly the Russian blades, the ones that are made in Russia. 
due to no sanctions or whatever. I guess I'm tired of hearing that stuff. A lot going on today in the world. And a lot of it's no good. I haven't updated everybody lately on my grandson. So I'll do that today. He, uh, you know, he went to South Korea for 12 months. He got done with that. He's been at Fort Campbell, Kentucky, which is only like 80 miles from us. And man, we have enjoyed that because he's been coming home on the weekends. But he got deployed uh, to Europe a few days ago. Flew on one of those big C-5 transport planes. And uh, he and he and one more soldier went out, went to Europe to uh, with a bunch of equipment. And uh, their job was is to offload it and get everything set up and ready for 3,400 more troops that are headed there. And once they get everything, their part done, him and the other guy, they go on the road to another place. And that's where he'll spend nine months. Flying those drones. I was kind of sad seeing him go because he's, like I said, been coming home on the weekends, but he's excited. When he leaves where he is now, he's actually going to drive a vehicle from where he is now to where he's going. And he'll go through several countries. It's about a 14-hour drive. And that's what he's excited about. I don't know why they have them driving instead of flying them. Who knows? But he don't care. So if he don't care, I don't care. Okay, back to the shave. So far, great. These perma sharps are nice. And I've I've just got so many other I got different brands of blades. But I only have those that I really enjoy using. My top blades are these Permasharps, Gillette Platinums, Astra SPs. That's the first pass. Very good one. Um, Gillette Platinum. Let's see, what else is it? Uh, Gillette Super Thins. Uh, is there any more? That's about it, I think. Did I say Astra? I think I did. I like the Astra SPs. To me, they're the smoothest blade out there. Are they the sharpest? I don't think they are. They're plenty sharp for me. 
I've never met a DE blade yet that wasn't sharp. <laughs> okay, I'm going to wet my face a little more. Lather set there. And got a little bit pasty on me. So we'll finish this up right quick and then we'll get shaving again. Hey, if you want a Yates razor, I think he's still got a sale going on. Go get you one. And use my code in the description of this video. And also, use my code on anything you buy at Razor Company. I've had a couple of those happen lately. That's, I appreciate that. It helps my channel out. I have a couple more brushes heading my way. That darn postal service. Nothing hardly ever comes when it's supposed to, but they aren't trotters. They are elite razor brushes, which I recently discovered. And man, do I ever like those things. I got one that I ordered from Elite Razor. I can't remember the fella's name that makes these. He's in Georgia, Roswell, Georgia. First name's Bob, I know that. And uh, he's fixing me up with a beautiful brush. Can't wait to get it. He has some fantastic knots. And he turns beautiful handles, too. Uh, razor Company sells some of his razors. So you can go to their website, look up Elite Razor. And they've got some of his brushes on their site. I want to give them a look and use my razor company code also. I know razor company's got something you need because they got everything. They just they're they've got a new location too, storefront location. They really they're really going gangbusters. I'm glad. They are very, very good to deal with. Now I'm on the stubborn part of my neck, so we're gonna take another swipe with the twar with the with the twatter. <laughs> the trotter. And work on this stubborn side of my face. You can hear that, that it was still left. Now it's getting gone. But boy, it, this side of my face is my my nemesis. Okay. It has been chilly here. It's been getting down in the 20s at night. We've had a couple of days where the high has been in the 40s. But I think it's supposed to be a little warmer today. And by the weekend, it's supposed to be back up in the 70s. So that's good. But I really don't mind cool weather. I 
supposed to be cool when it gets this time of year. You know, I almost cut my lip right then. I mean, not here, but my lip went too far up. Don't shave your lips. That's my wet shaving tip of the day. Don't shave your lips. And if you have whiskers on your lips, you got a problem. Go get seen about it. Okay, we're getting close. Oh boy, that was good under the nose. There we go. Another great shave. And now, get the old Allen block out, wet the face a little bit. Wet the Allen block. I don't feel anything. That's a good shave. The Allen block will tell on you if you haven't had a good shave. Okay, I'm going to wash out this brush and show you right quick. I'll show you the lather that's still in the thing. Look at there. Good gracious. Look at that. I have to shave two or three more times. And I've still got lather in the bowl. I want to show you the, I want to show you the tips on this thing. Look at there, look at those tips. Man, that's just, that's just awesome. And the brush itself is beautiful. Rinse this alum off, I wiped it off. And then we're going to get Randy's homemade bay rum splash. I got a little spray bottle here. Put a few, put a few sprays in my hand. Oh boy, that smells good. I'm telling you, that Hendrix in Hendrix Classics and Company bay rum is uh, just. It's just a great, great Bay Rum scent. And I see a lot online, I see a lot of people asking the question, you know, what's the best Bay Rum? And I can tell you, in my opinion, it, it's this right here. And as I said, now Sterling's is wonderful. The soap scent, I don't have their splash. Um, and I don't, I, I don't have it, I didn't buy it on purpose because I had this bottle and it don't take a lot of this oil to scent up a bottle like that when you make the when you make the splash yourself. Man, it smells good and it lasts and lasts and lasts. So, okay, where are we? We're at the uh, we're at the um, review time as to what we used. The Sterling Bay Rum Soap, you can see in there where I've been digging it out. 
I dig it. I, I dig it out with my little Denton Magic chip. Uh, I've got two or three of those that came with soaps that I bought. Uh, that's a neat idea that Mark Denton had. But um, the razor we used was the usual Yates 921M, which I also am in love with. And it was loaded with a Permasharp. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to reach for my Aveeno that I put on after I shave. Which makes everything wonderful. It also brings back the menthol. So, that's the shave for today. I just don't have much more to tell you. Um, it just went real well. It's a perfect shave. Got to stick that lather on my nose. I think that's lotion, the Aveeno on my nose. But, hey, I'm clean. I'm clean shaven, and that's what I was after. And I hope you enjoyed that. If you do, give it a thumbs up. Be sure and use the links in my description for Yates razors if you want our Yates razor. And for the razor company for anything else. Because they have a ton of stuff. And um, they sell, they even sell sterling soaps. You can get sterling soap there. Uh, they say they uh, sell HCNC stuff, Hendrix Classics. What else do they sell? They sell brushes. They sell the Elite brushes, Elite uh, razor brushes, um, all kinds of things. So they just keep getting more inventory and more inventory and a um, great place to shop. So go there. And I tell you what, like I said, I'm done. Until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Adios.